Well, a team of immigration, defense force, and police officers combed the eastern and southwestern districts of New Providence today, rounding up illegal migrants residing in shanty towns in those areas. And as a joint partnership aimed at tackling the influx of illegal migrants who are not only squatting on land, but are in this country illegally. LaDon Davis was first on the scene of that immigration raid and has the latest details in this report. At least 55 illegal migrants residing in shanty towns in the Joe Farrington and Carmichael Road areas were picked up by a team of immigration police and defense force officers during a four-hour raid Monday. Officer in charge of Immigration's Enforcement Unit, Kirkland Neely, confirmed this joint effort is just one of many operations to crack down on illegal migration in this country. Message to everybody in the Bahamas that as long as you're illegal, come forward, turn in yourself, because you might get away from us today or tomorrow, but eventually we can get you. Okay, So it's easier for you to turn in yourself and let us try see if we can help to repatriate you back to your homeland. We're not discriminating. We're not picking on Haitian and Jamaicans. That's everybody who here in the Bahamas illegal. Neely revealed that immigration apprehensions will occur three to four times per week and has nothing to do with the November 1st immigration deadline. Additionally, he provided an update on repatriation exercises over the past week. We repatriated 229 last week Wednesday. Back to Heidi and Amma, on Amma. Today is when at Jamaica we repatriated Amma back to Jamaica. We, we sent about uh, 20 to 21 Cubans back home Amma also last week. And, um, this week on Wednesday, we'll be sending another 12 or so Cuban back to to um, uh, to uh, back to Cuba. If you're aware that um, uh, my officers and I, we had to make a trip down to um, uh, Bimini yesterday and bring about bring back about 19 Cubans. So, so we have about I, I believe roughly about 50 Cubans at the detention center as we speak. Neely confirmed those illegal migrants apprehended in Monday's raid are currently detained at the Kamikaru Detention Center, awaiting processing and are expected to be repatriated sometime next week. LaDawn Davis, ZNS Network News.